Oh my gosh, I got a good one. I've got a good one. I've got three freaking bass. Are you serious? I've got three bass. Oh I've got God. three bass. I've got three bass. Oh I've got three God. bass. What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. It's Colin Jay, and as you can see, we are out on the lake today about to do some fall fishing. It's a beautiful day today, and we are out here on the boat with our buddy Jake. And our goal today is to grab around and find a mega school of bass somewhere and just try to light them up. This lake that we're fishing is known to have an abundant population of largemouth bass, and we hope that with this awesome weather we have today that we can just light them up somewhere. <laughs> if you're excited about fall fishing, be sure to hit the like button and the subscribe button. Now let's go catch some big bass. Let's do it, Jay. So here's the starting lineup for the day. We got a jig, deep diving crankbait, a Carolina rigged worm right here, and then we have a big old A rig. And I think I'm gonna start off by just chunking this plug around, see if we catch a big old bass on it. Should work. He knocked slack in it. I thought I was coming over something and then he started head shaking. And I was like, okay. Get it. Get it. I think I do. You get that bass. I got a bass. I got a bass. You get that bass. I've got a bass. You get that bass. You get that bass, Cole. Cole, you get that bass. Cole, you get that bass. Nice one, dude. Cole, get the bass. Plug in. Dude. Plug in. He's almost three pounds. That's a nice one, dude. I'll take it. I'm proud of you. I will take it. I'll see you sure like I'm gonna weigh in. I wanna know how big this fish is. I'm gonna say two pounds and twelve ounces. There's there's things. Two ten. There are things around. There are lots of things around. I'm gonna catch one of them. There he is. Yeah, should we throw this eight rig down there? Saw some shad get ran. I got a fish on the A rig. Oh my god. I got a fish on the A rig. Oh I've got a fish on the A rig. Oh my god. Oh, he feels big. I might have him snagged up weird. I might have more than one fish. Oh I've got a fish on the A rig. God, I've got a fish on the rig. First cast of the A rig, baby. It feels big. Fish? Jay's got a fish too. Oh my gosh, I got a good one. I've got a good one. I've got three freaking bass. I've got three bass. I've got three bass. I've got three bass. I've got three bass. Oh my god. Oh my god. Help. Help me. Help me. I've got three bass. I've got three bass. Help me out. Help me. Help me. Help me. Help me. I got one. Grab one. I'm gonna grab. I'm gonna grab the big one. Jay's got a giant. I got the big Give me the most. Oh my god. I got three bass. Jay's got a giant. Help Jay. Help Jay. Help Jay. Help Jay. She's got a giant. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hold on to it. I'm here. I'm here. Oh my gosh! Go, Ash, cool. you're good, you're good, get him, get him, Jake. Oh I've got three bass. Finish, finish, finish. You got him. Grab him, grab him, Jake. Grab him, Jake. Grab him, Jake. Grab him. Hit him out. Grab him out. Grab him out. Grab him out. Don't lose him. Grab him. Let's go. Woo! Let's go, baby. Are you kidding? Let's go, baby. I've got three bass. That's a dog. I've got That's three insane, bass. Dude. <laughs> 
We just put, how many pounds is that? Like, you frick, dude, like 10 pounds of bass? No, more than that. Oh my God. Guys, look at this mess we just came up in. So we, been out here messing around on the lake for a couple hours now and we just marked some fish and we caught a couple on a crankbait as you guys saw so i was like, i'm gonna throw this a-rig down there and see what happens i caught three freaking bass on an a-rig <laughs> and then jay hooks up with a five pounder i don't even know how big that was this is a good one this is like a three and a half or four pounder i don't even know but look at this I've i have never seen fish. anyone catch three fish i've seen people catch two fish at a time but three that might be a record i just caught three fish on the a-rig guys it's insane we got to get these fish unhooked and get them back first in the water cast on the a-rig first cast with the a-rig guys <laughs> I think I know what I'm gonna throw for a little bit now. <laughs> yeah. I couldn't move the fish. They hit it so hard. It was all at the same time too. Dang. Okay, so let me get these fish unhooked. Let's get a look at Jay's fish. Let's get some weights on these fish and uh, let's get back in the water and catch some more big fish. This is crazy! Yeah. Good job, Jay. Give wow. me like an elbow. <laughs> My hands are full. Boom. <laughs> okay, I'm going to let some of these fish go. So let me let, let me put this one up here for a second. Okay, I'm gonna let this first smaller one go. Okay. We will see. I snagged him in the head. That's all right. Okay, so, oh, he bit me. Ah, oh, he came back and bit me again. Okay, I got this other smaller one. Okay, so here's my second fish. Okay, we're gonna let you go. Bye, Felicia. We've got the live well going, so we're gonna actually put this bigger fish and Jay's fish in the well for a second. So let's get them welled up. Oh. Uh, we got one on the A rig, oh. baby. That's a good one. That is a good one. It is a good one. Only one though. Woo! They'll eat multiple swim baits all tied together in a chandelier fashion. Look at that. I just wonder if I put a normal jig head swim bait on. That's what I'm talking about. My second fish on an A-rig today. Too bad it wasn't, you know, another three more, but hey, I'll take it. Here we go, fish. Wow, that was a crazy like 10 minute flurry we just had. And now that it's died down, let's get these fish out and let's see how big they are. Jay's was definitely larger than mine, but the one I caught was pretty good. But we're gonna figure out just how big they really were. Oh, he's trying to jump out. Oh, 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 my gosh. oh he's feisty. Woo. Wow. There we go. Yeah, that is a nice Yeah, one. it ain't bad. I mean, those two that I caught along with this one on the A-Rig were quite a bit smaller, but that's gonna be getting pretty close to four pounds probably. He's probably a high three. So let's get him on the scale and see how big he is. Three and a half hey. pounds. Hey. Can you see that? Yeah. Not a bad fish. Woo! Not a bad fish at all. Those other two I caught were like right around two pounds. So I caught like seven pounds of fish, a little bit more than seven pounds of fish probably on one cast. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> so I'm gonna get this fish back in the water and uh, we're gonna weigh Jay's fish. All right, big girl, get back down there. Go get some big old shad. Sweet. Okay, now let's weigh Jay's fish. All right, I'm ready to see your fish again. Okay. It was beating me up whenever I was in there. Warning, it's a big one. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Oh, it's biting me. That is a big fish. That's a big bass. <laughs> He's so long. Yeah, super long. Hey. Let's see the weight on him real quick. Oh, Is it a five pounder? Oh, it's 412. 412, huh? Four pounds, 12 ounces. Dang. Dang. So close to a four pound or five pounder. That's still a really good fish. There he goes. Good job, Jay. That was awesome. Dude, what happened to our bite? Where did the fish go, man? Where'd they go? Dude, I fished this channel up and down just now. Never got a bite. It's That's true, wrong. guys. We have been fishing for three hours since we had that flurry of fish, and we've caught nothing. It's crazy. We caught all those fish. We probably caught 12 fish all together in a matter of like 30 minutes, 
and since then we've caught nothing. So I think we're gonna fish around for just a little bit longer and then we're gonna call it a day and head into the house. So we just made it back home from the lake and man, we had an awesome time out there today. Cole freaking caught three bass on one cast. Like that's so insane. I've never seen anything like that before. And then I caught the biggest fish of the day. So I would say that we were both winning on today's fishing mission. Yeah, we caught all those fish at the exact same time. It was a mess. It was crazy. It was hectic. You saw the footage. It was um, so fun. I think we caught like 12 and a half pounds of fish in one cast basically. Cause I had seven and a half pounds of fish. She basically had a five pounder. And that was just crazy. Is that the math right? Seven plus, yeah, 12 and a half pounds. Woo. And one will said, that'd be awesome on tournament day. So before we wrap up today's episode, we're gonna talk about the lures that got the job done today. Basically, it was just a combination of two lures, one being a Six Sense Cloud9 C15 deep diving crankbait. And the other was this big old beast of an A-Rig right here. So to target these fish, we were just mainly fishing a creek channel and it swung around this deep bank. And um, there were some fish loaded up on the point right there. And we saw them on the grab, we saw a bunch of bait fish, and we're like, okay, let's see if we can catch those fish. So we started firing out the crankbait, trying to get them fired up, and then we started catching one here, one there, and we caught like maybe three or four bass, and then I was like, okay, let's put that crankbait down, let's throw this <laughs> A-Rig out there, see if we can catch something crazy. So I picked it up, threw it out there, and loaded up on those three bass. It was wild. Crazy. And then while I was doing that, the school was still fired up, and Jay caught that five pounder. So that was awesome. Those are two baits we caught them with. Um, Jay actually was throwing this pole. I'm gonna show him that. This is the exact rig that I caught my fish on today. Yeah, so, that's, fish. Yeah, so that's a C15. That color is called Wild Shed. It's an awesome bait. And the rod she's using is a seven foot, 11 inch, um, six inch Lux series rod. And it's called the Cloud9 Cranker. It's a rod that was designed to throw these deep diamond crank baits. And they're available on their website. If you wanna check them out, we'll leave a link in our video description for that. And then, this rod that I'm using to throw this A-Rig is really cool. It's a new rod that came out with, it was in collaboration with another um, YouTube channel, Milliken Fishing. It's called the MFR Series Rod. It's a seven foot, nine inch extra heavy rod. Um, it was designed to throw like bigger swim baits and A-Rigs. And this rod was powerful and comfortable enough to throw this big A-Rig around all day, or for the majority of the day. So that is the gear that we were using to catch all the fish today. We will leave it all linked in our video description for you guys to check out. If you decide that you want to purchase some six cents fishing gear, um, you can use our code CJ10 and save 10% off anything on the site. So that's really awesome. And I guess this is where we're going to end today's episode. We want to say thank you to each and every one of you guys for tuning in and watching this adventure. We're hopeful we can get back out on the lake and catch some more big fish soon. Maybe catch five fish on A-Rig. That'd be like wow. the pinnacle of A-Rig fishing. If we can catch five bass <laughs> on A-Rig, maybe we can do it. Let's just start with four. We'll try to get four next time. Okay. We'll try to get Jay to catch four and me four at the same time. Put eight fish in the boat. Yes. Sound good? <laughs> Sounds good. Okay, so if you enjoyed this episode, be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel so you can keep up all our future outdoor adventures. We're Colin Jay, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye, guys. Bye.